Oh. Sorry. Oh no. I was joking. Oh it looks god like this damn it. Changed. What? Mine. Wait, who what the hell are you? Place is it? Oh. I died or just went crazy in prison. Well, that isn't important. In any case, now you're with me. Oh, this is so good. It's bringing it all together. Like, uh, again, is this like our inner, like, thoughts torturing us? Like, where, it, it, again, it seems it like all the stories boss, here right? involve losing family, right? Wrong. The blue wire wasn't here in the first place. No. Maybe you had a partner who gave you the wrong instructions. That's right, because there was no blue wire when we first tried. You are a good person after all. Oh, boy. This can't be true. Oh boy, run, run, run. It's the thing, it's the thing. Oh boy, run. Go, 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 go. What is this demon? Like, this looks like a necromorph. What the hell is this? Okay, go. No. Oh no, they're all here. Oh no, no, no. Oh boy. Hi, everyone. Hi. I'm sorry for robbing the house. Oh no, I hear a growl. Oh boy. I'm I'm expecting it. Okay. What no no. Yep, there you are. <laughs> oh good stuff. Oh man, they are really good at playing around with us. Alright, what do we got on the TV? Police it's a fire. The suspect in the arson of the home in East London has been detained. Oh. It turned out to be a 23-year-old native of London by the name. It was that us. The has ended in tragedy when the failed thief tried to turn off the alarm and caused a fire. The resulting fire led to the death of a family of three. Uh -huh. Married couple and a child were burnt alive due to the selfish... So is this what really family. happened? The suspect claims that he is not guilty since he didn't know about the presence of the people I mean, the you home. still killed After them, all, though. It's never his fault, is it? Aha, uh -huh. these are like our inner demons. Oh, this is good. We have meta narrative. Okay. So the it's house itself haunts it's us. Sparks are capable of. Don't be afraid. It wasn't really your fault. Oh my god, After yes. All, who knows who these people were? Kids. Abusers, oh god damn it. Monsters. So again, these are like the narratives that we've come up with to try to justify what we did. Oh god. Yeah, like these are our like mental justifications for why we aren't the bad guy. Let me give you a hint. Who is to blame? What are you imagining in your stories? The husband is guilty in the death of his wife. The wife killed her child. And the child is... I don't know. It was a monster. <laughs> sure, whatever. You know, whatever you want to whatever you want to feel. Oh, this is good. So what does it say? I want to look at the person who killed me. Um So I think I have to point them all towards the middle. Yes. Yes. So this is us coming to terms with the fact that we killed these people. That's right. An acceptance. I didn't expect this to happen. I didn't think we had to say goodbye. No, I mean, this is the truth. Fair so way. this is why, you know, he was talking about ignorance is bliss. Like, I think the the, the voice here, oh, I don't think it's going to be that easy. No, 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 no. I don't believe that for a second. You're going to slam that. Yep. Oh, yeah. It's a pity that acceptance cannot fix No, uh, uh, uh. There's no atonement there yet. Then you will remember this. No matter what you will imagine next. We will be together forever. Aha. Uh -huh. So, like, this is our tormentor. Like, the, the person on the, the radio is actually tormenting us like, over and over and over, making us go through the house and relive it. Oh, this is great. Meta narrative. So, what's, what, what, what is the next sequence? Because there's now, we, we've done four of them. Should the red door be open now? Yes. Let us relive this night again. This is like our purgatory. Like, reliving this terror again and again and again and again. And, like, it, it, like his imagination of this is, is trying to justify 
you know, why they died, right? You know, whether them they were a monster or they killed each other. This demon thing wasn't too much. Was it a good ending? There is no time. I need to leave it as it is. Since when did I start talking to myself? Oh. I can't take it anymore. Wait, hold on, hold on. I need to get distracted. The voice is us, I think. We are torturing ourselves. I think, yeah, it's not on the walkie-talkie. It's, it's, it's now in our own head or whatever. Okay, okay. So we've now finally opened the red jewel door. What is in here? Lately, I can't get my childhood out of my head. I don't know why. Oh? Why is that? Oh? Oh! Well, we're like back in his childhood. Up. My father took care of this. Okay. Director of the... Factory. Very powerful person. He had big plans. This is so wild. A complete change of locale. But first, I had some daily schedule to do. You must wake up at five, then homework, then school. Gotcha. Yeah. Routine. The real work. Oh, no. Okay. So it's a very scheduled out life. First year of a business school. Okay. So I guess this this is the, the person who, who was the, the robber, right? This is their childhood. Okay. Why? Wait, 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 wait. This is like, isn't this the most like infamous house in all of like horror or like, like, uh, like Unity games? Isn't this a famous like Unity asset? This looks really familiar. Oh no. Now the real work begins. Oh boy. Every oh. Day was a preparation for the future. I had goals. These are all like bringing all together like the images the of his life. The yeah. At 15. A senior assistant, head of the floor at 24. Yes. For my father at 31. There is no time for doubt. So, like the the butcher stuff from the the, the haunted house. Every day. Is part of his his imagination of like the psycho to. scene. I had no idea how, nowhere to go, and because of that, again and again. So is this? Oh boy. Oh yeah. So is this like the 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 kind of pathway that led him to his like life of crime as a way to, you know. Add excitement and thrill to his life of monotony. Because, yeah, the, the, this is, like, I'm assuming, like, again, why the butcher shop shows up in, like, or, like, the butcher room shows up in the basement of the mansion. Uh-huh. Did you now? What was your way out? What do we got? And, oh, man, that's a lot of X's. Oh, what do we got here? First... It didn't work out very well. Okay. Stupid stories. It's too embarrassing to even think about. Them. Oh. And they gave me the distraction then. Is this the the imagination of someone? Is the whole thing about someone like being like a, a like a creative writer? Okay, I'm into that. That's definitely a fun twist. The publisher. Yeah. The opportunity to leave. And at 18, on my birthday, I decided to do it. Oh, cool. Okay. Dear Mr. Mist. Oh my God. Yes. The Mists of Aiden. I apologize for the late reply, but I wanted time to, to, for myself and a colleague to read your work, The Grey Gentleman. Frankly, your style is qu isn't quite polished yet. However, I've been intrigued by your talent for creating an atmosphere and man maintaining dark tone. I still have goosebumps from your gloomy descriptions of an alien slaughterhouse. Please reply to this email if you still want to work with us. I believe that our proposal might interest you. Cool. Okay. Yeah, I think the idea is that Mr. Mist is like the the kid, or I guess, you know, he he turned 18 today or whatever. But he yes, 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 yes. Okay. Father was furious. He locked me up. Oh no. His educational methods stronger than usual. So is this the story of like his like abuse? In the past. I was able to leave, and that's what really matters. I left all this And he behind. became the author. I found a special girl. That's what's important. We have a wonderful baby. Oh. We lived happily ever after. Wait, or is this the story of the Until. people who were burned in the house because of the thief? Until. So is this what the house actually looked like? Okay. Because there's a fire here. Yeah, so like, is is this the, the interior thoughts of the, the, the guy... Who actually was in the house. Not the thief. Not the basement. Alright, let's head upstairs. This is very intriguing meta-narrative. It just keeps getting layered over and over and over. Like, what you think is actually happening <laughs> keeps expanding. 
It's such a cheerful, sunny day. I mean, this makes a lot more sense as a, as a reasonable size for a house, I guess. Yeah, so yeah, there's the chest, there's the crib. What do we got here? After uh, Only after this letter did we realize how serious the problem is. Dear Mr. and uh, Mrs. Mist, I'm sorry to inform you that Oliver's condition is getting worse. Um, uh, Rio Siguat will facilitate I, I'm, I'm his, uh, 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 Rio Guat will facilitate his well-being increase the quality of his life but it can't eliminate the cause of his heart problems oh right he needs a new heart I highly recommend you give your consent to more radical methods of treatment as soon as possible we prepared a medication regimen which has a chance to restore working of the uh, heart back to normal I doubt that surgery will be needed but I have to warn you that may be a possibility in the future we will discuss your son's treatment during your next visit so it was the son who actually did need... So it's about the loss of a son. Like, all these stories involve that. Interesting. So is that his way of dealing with the grief? Like, all these stories, back to, the, like, the very original. Each step up the stairs was marked by a lingering creak. A hatch in the ceiling has led him into the attic. A dark world that was deprived of all traces of sound and light. The only thing that could break the silence was the sound of the old camera. And the only thing that could help him to see was its broken camera flash. After a few long seconds, he finally found a door. Another flash of the camera helped him to see. They were here. Motionless figures. Short moment that was frozen in time. I erased all the unnecessary descriptions. The reader's attention must be solely focused on what he will see next. Interesting. Very cool. Uh, Rico Siguat, it is used to treat two forms of pulmonary hypertension. Okay, so it was talking about the medication. Cool, 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 cool. Good to know. What do we got here? We tried as best we could. It was all for nothing. Bills for treatment grew every month. Well, yes. My novel started to get rejected and in time. Oh, no. I got a second job, then started another one. That wasn't enough. That is we terrible. Chance. Healthcare should be universal, free uh, at uh, access point. This is how medicine should be working. Oh, God. Oh, the bills. The bills are the horror here. Bill after bill after bill after bill. That's the real, again, again, the real villain of the story here is privatized healthcare. The real monster. Not letting them focus on actually taking care of their child. Well, I don't know. Is it not said in the UK? Because I'm assuming that that would cover the cost, right? Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. What, what's, who's on the phone? Is he all right? Oh no. The doctor says that he's stable. Okay. That's good. Good. Have you taken a nap yet? I didn't have time. The operation just So ended. they did have to operate. How are you? Work. Uh, the part with the maniac is ready. I will write it. So in these time. The, the stories that we've Can experienced we are here long? are are You're already in his dead. narratives. They won't give us any more. I just need to finish it and You can call your father. Did, oh, the one who abandoned him. Yes. I've already spoken to him. He has plans for me, and now he has plans for Oliver. He he will break him. He is a monster. Yes. Aiden, I don't care who he is. I don't care even if he has horns and a tail. We're talking about our son. Yeah, right I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. Listen, if he gives us money, then we won't be able to oh, leave Oh, man. Him. Never. No, I... I will sell the book, and we will solve everything. Aiden... Your last work is still in your desk, along with the previous one. Oh, boy. How do you know that they'll buy this book? I mean, it's this pretty compelling. Is that I have. I promise you, this is my best work. Yeah, this is a, 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 a very it. dark Everything tale. Everything will be okay. Do you believe me? <sighs> one month, Aiden. I believe in you, Aiden. Then the mists of Aiden can succeed. Father. I can handle it. I promise. Just say that you believe me, and I will do everything. One month. I mean, that's not a lot of faith. <laughs> I understand, though. Like, if he has two books that went entirely unsold, then maybe you want to look at other options. Oh, this is this is interesting. So the four stories, or the three or four stories that we experienced before this, were him trying to put together a best-selling story so he could, uh, you know, pay for his son's medical expenses. And he, oh, is this the is this the real terror having to Aiden, to call the father? Are you okay? We need to talk. No, no, no. I just need to proofread this thing. A bit more time, 
Maybe a week oh, no. Let's open the door. More than a month has passed. And yeah. I know that you work. I just wanted to say that Oliver is stable. Okay. The doctor is waiting and... And? And? What do we got here? She will not believe me. Even if I tried to persuade her, it's either I'm finishing the book or... Or... Until recently, How I didn't know whether... Been inside? Oh, Aiden, God, he's become like a like a, a recluse. Both of you at the same time. Oh, no. We must solve this problem and solve it now. Your father will I mean, he sounds like he's not good. He's not so bad. Oh, so bad. Very, that's <laughs> very compelling. About the books. If he gets control, it will be the same with Oliver as it was with me. Oh, man. She doesn't understand. I guess that's the thing. Like, she, she is being... through whatever happens. As understanding as possible. I'm sure that not everything is so bad with your father. We will oh, talk to I don't know. We'll figure something out. Oliver asked about you. I said that you're working, but you'll visit him soon. He misses you. I, I bet he does, I but we too. really got to sort this thing out. Otherwise, door, he won't get any of the treatment you he further needs. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, Aiden, please. Well, let's open the door. I'll leave it all behind. I can work with my father. We can come up with something together, but... Oh God! I had a couple more days. A couple more days. Aiden, In. open the door. Open the door. It does not matter. It matters about solving the problem. Hello, Nadine. Yes, you got to take care of the the kid, even if it means dealing with the monster. Oh, this was very good. I'm sure there's like a multiple choice ending there, but you know, not succumbing to the madness feels like the correct choice. That's great. I I really enjoyed that. That was that was cool. It reminds me a lot of oh boy, uh, what, what was that? Stories untold. Stories untold. Very neat. Very clever. I think that game also has such a sharp look, like a lens focused on the tropes of horror and how to use them and subvert them. But yeah, this reminds me a lot of Stories Untold. Where, like, there are vignettes of smaller horror stories that are seemingly quite self-aware. And then there's a meta-narrative that links it all together. I won't say anything about it in case you uh, all haven't played the game or seen the, the, the playthrough. But I definitely recommend that game. That That is, so, like, yeah, Stories Untold is very cool. As well as, they are announced as a developer of one of the new Silent Hill games, which is so cool. I think they, they're a, a great choice because they also did Observation, uh, which was a fantastic sci-fi horror game. So I, I think they got the chops for it. I think they could do something really cool. But th this was another great game. I, I, I'm very keen to see what these developers uh, have also done because, yeah, Miss Abaden was a really cool experience. You know, at first, like, it is very much set up, like, mostly comedic, like, kind of like a silly like uh, heist that you're pulling off to get the jewel. Then, you know, things get a little spooky. You get chased by the, 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 the chainsaw wielding maniac and then it resets and you're like, oh, okay. So this is like a loop of some kind. And then you get back into it and things start changing and being different. But there, and you recognize the tropes. That's the key is that you recognize the tropes of the horror thing that it's experience, like that the experience is. Like they're very good at setting up reminding and paying off like the rules of three of of narrative right you know the setup is always a horror trope that you recognize from film television games and then reminding you about it as it's kind of breaking it up with little bits of comedy you know maybe some very light puzzle solving and then the payoff is like the the the, the climax of each of the 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 the, the, the mini narratives where they fully unleash the the classic stuff but then they wrap it ball all back together in that it being the 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 narrative of someone trying to come up with horror stories that never quite go anywhere for them, right? So that's why it's like rewinding again and again and again, I think. At least in my interpretation, that's why it always keeps going back to the beginning. Because he, he can't settle on a way to tell the story. And that's why the, the, the last one just kind of ends abruptly. And he's like, you know, it's fine. The demon thing's a little over the top, but it's it's what we got to do. Like, the idea is, like, the game is is him developing the story that he's trying to sell so he can pay for the medical expenses. The real, the real terror here. This was this was really cool. I, and I, I definitely think 
a, a, a great like the horror was 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 people the whole time, right? The horror was bureaucracy and, and private healthcare. <laughs> no, that that's good. I, I feel like there was another game that we played that, that that was the case where like the the real horror was the lack of medical care. No, this this was really cool. I I, I think it's hard to pull this off because you have to have such a a wide knowledge base of like what works for for different horror subgenres. But boy, they they had a firm handle on the wheel, and and this turned out a really neat game. I, I'm I'm really uh, happy we took a look at this, and I hope you enjoyed coming along for the ride. <laughs>